What's up, gentlemen? So the other day, I got an email from one of our friends. He said, hey, do you agree with this YouTuber who says that you shouldn't wear leather jackets if you're over the age of 40? And since I'm 45 and I wear leather jackets all the time, this got me thinking that she's a idiot. Or maybe I'm the idiot. Nope, I'm not. Gentlemen, if you agree, why don't you drop me one of these and be like, yo, Alpha, you might be old, you might be wearing leather, but it doesn't mean it looks bad on you, gentlemen, and that's what we're talking about today. I'm going over some style rules that stylish men break that you should break too. Which brings us to the first rule that stylish men break, and that is don't dress your age. So as I've been getting a little bit older, I've been thinking a little bit more about this whole concept of age appropriate, right? What does it mean? You know, does it mean that once you hit a certain arbitrary number or age that you can't wear leather? Does it mean I can't wear slim fit gray denim? Does it mean I can't wear super sexy badass shades? Speaking of badass shades, Enemy is having our badass Black Friday blowout sale starting. Now, if you guys hit that link down below, go to enemy.com, you're gonna get 25% off site wide. Guys, you're also gonna get a free travel case with every order of sunglasses, which means you're getting 25% off plus a $15 free travel case gift. Guys, there is a limited time. This is not going to last long, literally 48 hours. So if you're interested in grabbing a sexy ass pair of badass shades, gentlemen, enemy ones, twos, threes, or fours, hit the link down below and get shopping because, well, they're sexy. Stylish guys are breaking the rules when it comes to dressing age appropriate. If I want to rock it, if I want to wear it, if it makes me feel good, if it makes me feel confident, if I feel like a sex machine when I throw it on, gentlemen, do not let any anybody tell you otherwise. You rock whatever the hell you want. Don't worry about what other people say that it's not age appropriate. What the hell does age appropriate mean? This also goes for younger dudes. If you're a younger dude and you want to dress up a little bit more, rock a suit to school, gentlemen. Rock that shit to school. It is your world, your life, your style. Own it. The second rule that stylish men break that you should start breaking to in order to look extra sexy is wear brown and black together. Brown and black together? They say not to do that. They do say not to to do that. I say to do it, gentlemen. Break the rule, and this is going to be the result. A super badass color combination that everybody else isn't going to do, but you're going to, and you're going to look extra sexy, all right? Check it out. I went with brown boots, black jeans, black t-shirt, brown belt, and a brown jacket. Gentlemen, does this look like it doesn't match? Does it look unstylish? I say no. It looks super sexy. Check it out. Here's another one of my favorite color combinations. Light tan or camel with the black is another amazing look, right? Went with the driving jacket, went with the suede boots, black jeans, black t-shirt, killer sexy black enemy glasses, or you could rock a pair of tortoise, right? And the reason why I love tortoise so much in terms of glasses is because of the contrast between the tan and the darker brown or black, right? It looks amazing when combined and worn properly. Gentlemen, if you want to upgrade and elevate your style, start combining black with browns and tans. It's a killer way to set you apart from 99% of basic boring dudes. Dudes. The third rule that stylish men break is showing 60%. From the top of your shoulder down to where it bends, gentlemen, you want to make sure that about 60% is exposed in order to expose the tricep. If your sleeves are too long, your arms are going to look itty bitty, gentlemen. It's about boom, getting them up. It's all about tricep exposure, guys, in order to make your arm look as big and as sexy as possible. Now, if your current t-shirts are coming down and covering more than 60% of your guns, what I recommend is simply cuff them up up or roll them up one time in order to elevate the T. Now, when it comes to rolling up your sleeves, I would say 70% is what you should be shooting for, all right? The whole idea is that you want to make sure you're getting it past the lower portion of your forearm, all right? Right about there is where I would say would be appropriate, right? The whole idea and concept is you want to make sure you're exposing the larger part of your forearm because as you know, women find forearms super sexy, but they can't be sexy if they're all covered and you're only exposing like 40%. The next rule that stylish guys, or I should say sexy guys, break that everybody else is like, oh, I don't want to show too much man cleavage. Man cleavage. <laughs> but my mom said never to unbutton three buttons or else I'm going to look too sexy. Your mom doesn't want you to look sexy, but Alpha does. Gentlemen, Ready, ready? Hoo, 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 hoo. I just let it out. You feel it? Did you feel it, gentlemen? The truth is, if you want to upgrade and elevate your attraction game when you're wearing a button up, gentlemen, boom. Three buttons undone is absolutely not only appropriate, it's extra sexy. The fifth rule that stylish guys break that you need to break to is never leave home without at least three accessories on. Three accessories is what I would recommend in terms of stepping outside of your style box. All right, now for me, my main accessory 
series are A Watch Always, My Badass M Ring, which you can also get on enemy.com. Did you know that we sell the custom accessories? We do, they're down below. Um, also, gentlemen, boom, sunglasses, what? Those are my three accessories. I'm wearing a badass watch, a badass pair of shades, and a ring. We sell custom signet rings at enemy.com. My jeweler, the guy who makes them, makes them for you. All you gotta do is tell us your ring size and what letter you want, whether or not it's uppercase, lowercase, and he'll make it for you. Now, it takes a few weeks because they are custom, but they are crazy high quality. We have two different sizes. Anyway, if you wanna check out the rings or accessories, guys, hit the link and check out enemy.com. Also, if you wanna get yourself a super sexy, badass pair of premium shades for under $100, there's also gonna be a limited time discount code down below if you wanna grab them. We're never gonna find a cleaner, sexier, higher quality pair of sunglasses for a better price. We use Zeiss lenses, Mazzacholi, Italian acetate, spring hinges. Guys, we also have polarized options now, whatever you want. We've got four super perfect badass styles. The enemy ones are, in my opinion, perfect for everybody, right? Because they're nice, they're clean, they're classic. The enemy twos, a little bit more daring. Enemy threes are our version of an aviator. And the enemy fours are super badass. They're a little bit larger of a sunglass and look stupid on me, but might look amazing on you. Since we're talking about accessories, guys, another one that you need to pay attention to is your wallet, right? If you're rocking a big, fat, worn out wallet, guys, it's gonna throw off the symmetry of your jeans. It also looks nasty when you pull it out to pay. So if you're looking to upgrade your wallet game, guys, at Enemy, we also have super premium, amazing wallets for an incredible price. We've got two styles, right? We've got one that's your classic, minimal, slim wallet, all right? It's not too big, it's not too bulky like those tri-folds. We also have the slim card holders, right? Three slots on each side and a center slot for your cash. Guys, these are super premium, high quality. We sell them individually or you can actually buy them as a set. These things also make an amazing holiday gift. Hit the link down below, check out enemy.com. There's also going to be a limited time discount code if you want to treat yourself to looking sexier. The sixth style rule that you should be breaking is never overdress. I'm not talking about wearing like a tuxedo to like a bar with the boys, but the truth is guys, if you want to start elevating and utilizing those nicer clothes, I highly recommend start to dress up regardless of where you're going. It's a great way to set yourself apart and also is going to make you stand out from everybody else. A lot of guys think that they can only wear their suit when they're going to some formal function, right? When the truth is that you should be breaking out and rocking that suit more often than that because you're not only going to feel amazing, you're going to look incredible. You're also going to stand out from all the other basic boring dudes for all the right reasons. An easy way to dress down a suit, guys, is to ditch the tie. It's a great way to still look elevated and sophisticated without looking like too buttoned up, right? When you throw the tie on, this definitely is going to lend itself or lean a little bit more dressy. Now, one little thing you need to understand, if you are going to actually rock that suit and dress up a little bit, you got to be ready for people to make comments, especially your friends that are boring, basic dudes, right? They're going to be like, oh, damn, Jimmy, you're all dressed up. Why are you wearing a suit? Be like, because I wanted to look sexy. That's it. Because I wanted to look sexy, right? And he's gonna be like, ho, ho, ho. And his girl's gonna be like, ooh. And he's gonna be like, wait a second. And then all night, he's gonna be watching his girl like a hawk because he's worried, right? Because he should be. Because she's giving you the, giving you the side eye and trying to like lead you and lure you into, into the kitchen to make out a little bit under the mistletoe. What? Exactly. All right, and this last style rule, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get a little heat for it, right? Because whenever I say this, you're like, yeah, but that's not true, they wouldn't. Okay, right, right, here it is. Stylish guys never let women pick out their clothes. Your style is your responsibility. Do not leave it up to anybody else. You need to love what you wear. You need to look in the mirror and be like, damn, I wanna make out with me. If you don't wanna make out with yourself, how's anybody else gonna wanna make out with you, gentlemen? You gotta own it. You gotta own your style. You gotta own your grooming. You gotta own your signature scent. It is about creating a package, a pleasing aesthetic that not only is going to make you feel amazing, it's going to attract those spicy senoritas like a moth to a style flame.